everybody? Welcome back to our channel. My name is Terrell. And my name is Brendan. And we are VNT Reacts. And today we are checking out. I tested weird Japanese products so Ooh. you don't have to. Wine, World of Extra. And this is by World of Extra. Yeah, definitely a stretch. Check out more World of Extra. Y'all know we love some World of Extra over here. Um, So we're going to be checking out some Japanese products. It's a very interesting um concept to do. Um, Because a lot of, you know, a lot of different... um Even here in like the United States, like we... We have different things in each state. Like, we don't have certain things that other states have. So, like, other countries, obviously, or other places around the world, obviously, we all don't have the same thing. So, seeing Japanese products that we probably have never seen in our lives yeah. ever being tried out. And the, then the weird Japanese products, it's, it's going to be very intriguing and interesting. Yeah, very niche, interesting product. Yeah. But before we get into it, make sure you hit the subscribe button and also like the video. But let's get into it. Let's go. What an extra. Ooh. Oh. If you love Japan, your probably category should be out as one of the following. The land of anime. The birthplace of tentacle pornography. I don't know. I'm sorry. The of Mount Fuji. But most of you probably consider Japan as the future. Ooh, my. I am living in the future. From mini candy burgers that you make from powders to this little contraption. Stan, what the fuck is that? This is called Hokkaido, and this is Japanese people's favorite thing in the entire world in the winter. You literally just take it out of the packaging and it heats itself up. And Japanese people just stick this everywhere in their clothes to keep them warm throughout the winter when they're outside. And there's mm. also a like, summer version to this that keeps you cold in the summer. Summer is like, like, like what kind of get to yeah, yeah. Which makes me question, is Japan really the future? Or what is was that? Too hard and it's getting weird at this point. Because I'm about the scientific method, the other day I went to Daiso and chose at least 10 weird things and tested it with you guys. And even made a tier list to see if Japan oh, is actually the future I love the little stickers again. on his wall. I ended up getting 17 items and I want to try every single one of them. 17? I'm going to start with the electric nail trimmer. Honestly, I don't know why you can't just use a normal nail cutter. Mm -hmm. When it comes to innovations, I want you guys to remember that it's not about how cool something looks. It's more about it's whether or not it's or convenient works. or it could replace something that already exists like a normal nail cutter. Right. Anyway, this was honestly so scary. Let me show you how it works. <gasps> that looks horrifying. Is it just it's like a, a torture device? It's giving saw trap. Oh, uh, yeah, no. That is giving saw trap. I'm going to go with the finger. regular normal tremor. Is it like to shape nails, I mean, maybe? The fuck? It also comes with this little brush. You... Maybe it's like to help shape the nails. Yeah, this is not giving. I gave it a few more tries, but my nails ended up looking like this. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Yeah, giving me low back. <laughs> The next item is a face trainer. Now, Japan has really weird beauty standards, and one of the main beauty standards in Japan is having a smaller, narrower face. Like me. Shut the fuck up, I've already had a small, narrow face before my surgery and after my surgery, so don't even don't talk about my surgery, shut the fuck up. So with that said, this is what the device looks like. It's that, that, that was a good that transition. Was just just literally that transition. For two to three hours a day. Minutes. Minutes. Well, I guess it is like a workout device, but considering that you look like this while doing it, uh, I mean, I'm just wondering, like, it's not even that hard. Is this really going to change anything in your face? I'm sure that the except that you do is enough exercise. Oh my god. I have something else to say about this, though. <laughs> <laughs> my mom says she believes in it and she's gonna start using it so i guess it's not entirely bad so i would put this under hmm, i wouldn't buy it but if someone gave it to me it would be a semi slay but if someone did give that to me i would feel like they're calling me a big face mama so i would just go <laughs> so the next item is mizune fukurama sponge apparently these are sponges they were basically these little pieces of shits Oh yeah, you put them in water. Pills, so you yeah, I think water, we have, we, we yeah, have yeah. stuff like that. I think this one is actually exciting. Okay, so the pills just look like this. And we'll yeah. just put them in water. While we wait for that, I also got this. This has actually been a really big thing in Japan recently, I've noticed. Personally, I don't think it's a necessity. But basically, you put a disposable straw like this. It comes with one disposable straw. So if you want to keep using this, you're going to have to buy a lot of disposable straws. Which, you know, Como City said kills all the turtles in the entire world. So if you buy this, you're a bad person. But basically, you take your water bottle and switch out the cap for this. And now your water bottle is not boring. Now we have a hello. No, that's water too much. Yeah, no. <laughs> it has a hole here too, so it doesn't shrink when you suck it. But personally, I don't think you even. Oh, ah, oh. <laughs> for a little bit now, and being a professional sucker, I've learned two things. Number one is a size does not matter when it comes to it. But more importantly, you don't need a straw to use this. You can literally just go like I'm this. I'm gonna say it. <laughs> Not like that. But as I was saying, you can literally just go like this and start sucking on it. 
It's just like the little like yeah. nipple tops. I think it's also really good for the environment because you get to reuse a lot of plastic bottles. Because now I'm going to be reusing this water bottle for like five more uses. Given that Japan is known for... Yeah, that's good. Japan like the things, I would give this bottles. a Japan 8 out of 10. Japan has all these really weird toys that you can do in the bath. And almost every single household in Japan has a tiny little bathtub. And you would know that if you watched my last video. Which reminds me, thank you so much to Nev for watching and commenting on my last video. If you guys want a shout out on my next video, please leave a money emoji. This okay. bath bomb is pregnant with disgusting little insects. Okay. <laughs> I know, bitch. Just you wait. Just you wait. We're not gonna use Lush here. We're gonna use this insect bath bomb. Okay. Ooh, that smells so good. Wait, I'm gonna take a bath in this. I mean, like, this is the size of Japanese bathtubs anyway. Oh my god. Ooh. That's scary as so shit. Confused. Is it supposed to be like you put your child in the bathtub and wait for that shit to hatch until your child Yeah, like, do you want to scare them? So, yeah, I was a prankster. I love this. Japan's age. Anyway, <laughs> while you wait for your poor little child to bang for his life, this is something you can give him to distract him a little bit. This is apparently a bubble maker. So what you do with a bubble maker is first, you're gonna wet it. And you add some shampoo. We're gonna use this really expensive one. Then you're gonna ask your child to blow on it. <gasps> okay, that's oh. late. That actually slays. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that oh, that's a lot. Yeah, that's, that's a, a slay. I like that. Help! Yay, this is so fun. This is so no, fun. but if you give your child that, that would be a mess around the house. You oh do it in God. the tub. For the next item, this might be really helpful for people with pets. This is a lint roller. You roll the lint like this. As you can see, it's removing a lot of the lint. Stan, what the fuck? You thought you ate? You have lint rollers in our country too. But bitch, but does it do this? this? <laughs> what did that do? Yeah, it is honestly kind of a little bit stupid. See, the thing is, the lint remover only goes one direction. So when you lint roll one arm, you can't just like switch to the other hand and then do the other arm. You have to spin her. And then oh. You know what I'm saying? Bitch, it makes sense. It makes sense. Okay. Bitch, I don't know about you, but Japan ate. <laughs> oh my god. The next item. What is oh, it? Don't walk don't away. Walk I'm gonna show you, but it's not what you not think, think it is. <laughs> oh, we have those at my job. Okay, maybe well, I'm the only yeah, they're like for um when you get cut. Yeah. Girl, what the fuck is you talking about? This is basically gloves, but for your fingers. But you actually don't have to use it on all your fingers. <laughs> it's basically just like a finger condom. But you might be wondering, Stan, what is that for? Like, why do you need to put that on your two little fingies? Well, let me show you. Oh my god, I can't flip the pages. It's so hard to flip the pages. Oh my god. What would you do if when you okay, so he said yes would go? Um... I'm gonna say them pages are gonna be hard to play. <laughs> oh, before you say anything, you're ungrateful little bitch. How many of you lick your fingers to flip the pages? But Stan, how about those little things where you wet your fingers? That bitch. So are you <laughs> wetting your important documents? Huh? Exactly. Some people actually have jobs. Oh, and they need to deal with a lot of papers, a lot of documents, especially here in Japan. So they have this little finger glove, so it's easy for them to grab papers. Okay. Japan hmm. 8 out of 10. Okay, so we are moving to the kitchen oh. because the next items are actually for food. I'm really hungry. I haven't had lunch yet, and it's 3 3 p.m. So let's start with this. I'm going to make boiled eggs. And apparently, this is tamago no pudding anake. Apparently, this makes your boiled eggs really easy to peel. This is what it looks like. Is this oh. an innovation? Or is Japan just well, like, work. We need take that. a little device? Yeah. And what you're gonna do is place the egg and push down that's it look at how tiny the hole is and then you're probably like oh my god stan where are you gonna store that you're gonna lose that stand you're gonna lose that in the kitchen because you have a lot of things in the kitchen i was a magnet <laughs> Japan. We are also going to make dashimaki tamago. This is Japanese omelette. Japanese omelette is not hard to make if you use something like this. And Daiso actually has a lot of kitchen things. This is gonna be really fun and easy. First, you take a big tablespoon, add a tablespoon of water, and then you crack a medium egg. And then you beat the egg. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 
life as a YouTuber. And then you're gonna put this in the microwave at 500 watts for 40 seconds. While I waited for that to cook, I also tried meat in a little packet. This one was yakisoba flavored tonkatsu, and tonkatsu is basically breaded pork chops. And it literally looks like actual katsu, like meat. Oh wow. <laughs> That's, that's so weird. Oh, yeah. It tasted like real tonkatsu and yakisoba. This oh. one is a 10 out of 10. Japan egg. Anyway, you take your egg and then we're gonna put a little bit of dust. And then it said to put it again in the microwave for 40 seconds, 500 watts. The same thing. Oh my god, it kind of looks like an omelet. It's oh sad. shit. Use this to flatten it right away and wait for one minute. I'm gonna take out this egg. Okay, let's see how easy it is to peel the egg. <laughs> Oh, wow. The egg was so easy to peel. I would have to give this to Japan. I wish more of the things flopped, but Japan has really just been eating the game this week. Right, you want to send me one of those? Oh, not Yeah, we need one of those, then. Remember those little pieces of shit? <laughs> or yeah, couple. after literally almost an hour, they finally decided to hatch. Also, is it just me when I read sponge? I thought sponges to wash dishes with. You know, something no, it's just useful. like a me low vibrations it was super anticlimactic i do not claim the energy so i decided to dispose of it properly like the garbage it is and i know it was a problem of expectation but these little pieces of shit annoyed me anyway <laughs> what the what is that Okay, I know you're confused, but that was a vegetable that... cutter. Basically, I also got this spinning vegetable cutter from Daiso, and needless to say, it works. I do not know what demon possessed me to put an egg in there, but I do not claim the energy. Mmm, disgusting. Also, I didn't know what to disgusting. expect, but it's Japan, I guess. So, of course, the omelette was perfect as well. I was obsessed with it. I was feeding a type of way when I was eating all this egg. It gave me sensations I've never felt before. Okay, calm down. It's not that dramatic. Now. I was also gonna do this unchiyaki, and unchiyaki is literally roasted poop. But I think that... Yeah, I'm gonna say, I don't like the, the shape of I'm gonna do it on my mom's channel. Anyway, you guys, that's it for today's I video. I wanna know the- I wanna see the Japan poop. Japan ate in general, and I guess some things are weird, I wanna see the roasted poop. Japan is futuristic and free advanced, and Japan ate- So I guess! Japan ate! Anyway, if <laughs> you guys don't watch, please subscribe, and I'll see you guys on my next video next week. All right, that is the end the of the video. Poo. You can go see the roasted poop. I want to see the no roasted poop. poop. I don't want to see no poop. That doesn't sound like a good food. I, I mean, want to see any food that's shaped like a poop. That's roasted that's not. Poop. Poop. Um, but roasted listen, this video, poop. this video was very uh, funny. It was very entertaining. Again, these products were very um. It was very intriguing to see some of these products. We have some weird products here in the U.S. as well. Um, yeah. Some I would never try. I'm like absolutely not. It's a scam. I mean, like before, like um. Before a lot of things were like sold on like um the internet per se um like before like the Amazon's really got big and all like the the major shopping online stores and things got big um they used to be like doing them as as seen on TV uh, commercials yeah and they used to try to sell you everything under the water everything under the water under um, the water. Under the bridge whatever the sun and it was um everything under the sun bridge water whatever uh and it was um it, it was it was um well things are under the water. So it can be under the yeah, water. Yeah, but the saying is everything under the well, sun. Well, but the saying is under the water to me. Because that's... And they're trying to tell you everything under the water. Listen, them, them, them um, products were crazy. I was not falling for it. Some of them actually worked out. Some products, they, they got it, but... Yeah. yeah. But some of these products, he was saying, I was like, okay, I'll get, like, the egg thing. I think it'll be a good idea. But yeah. some of them were like, mm, nah. What would you think, though? Um, I agree, yeah. The, seeing the crazy products, um... It was it was very interesting. Um, this video in general, though, I actually really enjoyed it. Um, oh. it was just so chaotic, and as always, love World of Extra. Um, but I don't know. I really just was loving the chaos, the ra weird spastic e editing, and just like the sound effects, the clips, everything. Yeah. It was just so funny, and I had a great time. I loved yeah. it. Well, all right, John. Let's hope for this reaction. If you like it, please make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you also hit the subscribe button. Go ahead and comment down below what you thought about this reaction, and if you want to check out more videos like this one, we will. And make sure to follow our second channel. Check out our Discord. Check out our separate channels and all of our social media. Yes, that was all for this reaction. And we're out. Bye. Bye.